Good morning. Today we're here at Big Lots. We're going to go and check out some of the prices, some of the things you guys have asked about, and check the shelves. Let's get to it. Okay, so as soon as I come into Big Lots here, the first thing I wanted to check is sugar. We've been getting a lot of comments that Domino Sugar has kind of been going out the door. We do have the four pound bags here at Big Lots for $3.99, and they've got the uh, cylinder canisters here, which we don't even really find anymore for $5.99. Part of the reason we are at Big Lots today, we've had a lot of comments over the past week here of a lot of baking staples that people haven't been able to find in the store. So we're going to try and point some of those out today that we have gotten in the comments. Here's another one here, uh, cherry pie filling. Now we have been pointing out like uh, Aldi and Meyer. We saw it was very low at Kroger the other day. These are $4.29, so pretty pricey. A um, little over $2 at Aldi for their same size can. We are one week away from Christmas here. This is a big reason why I wanted to come here too because, you know, to point out some of these things, if you can't find them in some of the stores by you, you may want to check out Big Lots. One of them being distilled white vinegar. Uh, they have this big container of it here for $3.49. This has been another one. We haven't had much of an issue here uh, in Cincinnati, Ohio, but... It's, we've been getting a lot of comments on it again. Uh, we did have an issue with it months ago, but they do have it here for $3.49 for the big jug. We've had some comments on Crisco, uh, mostly the vegetable oil. They are $5.99 here at Big Lots, mostly $5 around here. They're $5 right now at Kroger and um, $5 at Walmart also. $5.99 here, but we've gotten comments that you haven't been able to, some people haven't been able to find it. So you can see it's low here too. They've only got one of the vegetable oil, but it is another option. I had a feeling it would be a problem. It has been an issue around here. We've been seeing places all around here. Kroger, Walmart, Target. Uh, Meyer seems to be fully stacked all the time. Also Aldi seems to have plenty of spices, but definitely low here at Big Lots. Uh, now one thing I will say is some of these sizes are pretty good. We got good, good comments on the Fresh Finds uh, spices here, and this is a lot more than what you're gonna get at Walmart. For a dollar so good deal here but you can see we're even here it's very low we've been getting a lot of comments on spices lately so just want to point this out again another option it's been a little while but back before thanksgiving we got a few comments that some people are having trouble finding salt morton salt they do have it here it is a dollar 29 we sell it for a dollar 19 at target the other day um, but their name brand their brand was 59 cents usually the store brands are going to be a lot cheaper um, and yeah, we've had an issue too, not so much as of late, but I remember six, seven months ago, it was very hard to find salt. So I know we've gotten some comments on this, so I want to point this out again. Um, I know I probably keep saying this, but Big Lots is another option. Sometimes it won't be the cheapest, but if it's something you need, especially for baking for the holidays, you may want to spend that extra dollar just to know you have it. Two things here. We keep getting comments on pickles. Uh, now, we seem to find Vlasic pickles pretty much everywhere, and we've been getting Mount Olive pickles everywhere, too. But Vlasic's been a big one that some people have been uh, leaving in the comments. They do have them here at Big Lots. And another one has been jelly jam. Lots of jams and jelly have been low around here, too, and we've been getting comments on them. Uh, they're very low on peanut butter also, which is kind of funny because they usually always are fully loaded here with peanut butter. I don't know if they're not getting it in or what. They do have some olives here. Been getting comments on olives. Uh, they got the big uh, medium-sized olives here for $1.79 a can. Pitted ripe olives. They do have Heinz ketchup, the 38-ounce bottles here, which you can see it's pretty low, and there's probably a good reason for that. $3.99. This is something I would definitely take a photo of. Take a picture so you can take it up to the register in case they haven't, or if they've changed the price on this, because I have not found Heinz ketchup in like a regular store we usually find it a little cheaper like sam's club or costco but 3.99 for this is a pretty good deal because most places it's been actually over five dollars i always like to point out the campbell soups when i'm here the chicken noodle and tomato chicken noodle 25 percent bigger same price as the 10.5 ounce can at kroger but you're getting 25 percent more some people are saying this one you don't add water you do you do add water to that making it a uh, true 25% more. So these cream of soups are a regular price of $1.50 here at Big Lots. These are on sale at Kroger 
uh, four for five dollars this week, so you can get them for a dollar twenty-five a can there. Um, yeah, it's just crazy how expensive these have gotten. Now I don't see any distilled water here, but they do have. 24 packs of water they got some of the crystal geyser which we've gotten some comments on now it does say limited due to limited quantities only six per customer so yeah well <laughs> six of these wow uh 3.99 though 3.99 we've been seeing 24 packs of water. ice mountain regular price at kroger is 5.99 now for a 24 pack uh, now they have had it on some sales and have kept it on sale for right around 4.99 but 3.99 we've had crystal guys are before pretty good it's water we got a comment on band-aids again and it is fairly low here they do have some but we have been having this issue again too we saw the other day at target there was next to none um, we did see a, a bunch at walmart so especially their equate brand they had a bunch of those and those are a lot cheaper um somebody also asked about some over-the-counter medicines uh you know that seems to be a bit of an issue when it comes to like big lots and family dollar and a lot of convenience stores i don't call them value stores anymore i'd say convenience stores because they're more expensive and yeah you never know if they're going to have it or not but big lots has been low on over-the-counter medicine for pretty good while now um they do have tylenol i don't see any children's uh, Tylenol. I know that's that's one everybody's been looking for. We did find some children's Tylenol at Kroger Marketplace. That's the only place that I have been able to find children's Tylenol uh, next to Walgreens. They had them l like a month ago, and now it's it was out at Walgreens when I went there the other day. But they, you know, they are getting some stuff in. They are getting some ibuprofen and some Tylenol. I don't see any aspirin. I don't know. I guess they. Uh, I guess they don't have any aspirin in, but they've got some allergy medicines and stuff like that. Kind of their version of Flonase. Oh, that seems pretty cheap. But, yeah, it is, uh, they continue to get wiped out or they're just not getting a lot of this stuff in. I did just find one box of children's Motrin here. Children's Motrin. This aisle right here is kind of where Big Lots really shines for me because they have all different kinds of snacking, peanuts and almonds and cashews and really for okay prices compared to what they are in the grocery store like they do have the superior nut almonds here 349 this i feel like this would be five or six dollars anywhere else um i know the honey roasted cashews are amazing uh i think this is them nope cashew they rarely have them in anymore this is the premium mix i don't know how much that is some of them you do gotta kind of look around for the price but uh yeah uh it's a it's a good mix of different options here like this right here uh it's like 14.99 for the target good and gather brand of the roasted and salted cashews halves and pieces 11.99 here so way cheaper did find these imperial um nuts and snack mixes here two for ten must buy two i guess the ones that are 5.99 because it doesn't say a size on here but I guess that's this one, $5.99, two for 10. I mean, Imperial Nuts is a pretty big name brand. And the funny thing is that the only places we can really find them anymore are places like Ollie's, Big Lots. I don't know if maybe they're going out of business. I really don't know. But um, yeah, it's hard to find them in stores anymore. I think I did see them out of Jungle Gems, which is a big international farmer's market north of here. Um, but yeah, other than that, that's the only other place I've seen them. And they do carry a lot of snacks, usually a, a few pennies cheaper than some of the grocery stores now. Like these cans of Pringles are $1.99. $1.99 here, they've gone up to $2.19 at Kroger. So about 20 cents cheaper. Not sure how much combos are these days. $2.29. I mean, I remember when they were $1.99 a while ago. I haven't had them for a while. I'm not surprised they're $2.29 now. But once you get into like Doritos and stuff like that here, it can get a little pricey. I uh, normally want to find a deal on those that like a great, you know, I've, we've seen some deals where you can buy three, um, get so much off, you know, which makes it a better deal. But if not, yeah, you're usually going to pay more for like, you know, ruffles and Doritos and stuff like that. Well, I don't, okay. Well, $3.99. What is this on the bag? I know. Yeah, $5.59 is the price on the bag. Wow, that's cheaper than Target. 
Okay, so I wanted to check out some of the coffee options here. We've gotten mixed reviews on the Victor Allen here coffee. I've tried a couple different kinds. I'm not really a fan. Uh, $5.49 for 12 of the Keurig pods. I don't even think they sell the ground coffee of the Victor Allen here. Um, they do have some like McCafe here, the 12 pods, $7.49 and $7.99. These are regular prices too, guys. I mean, this is a dollar cheaper than Kroger off for the regular price. So that's good to see. Um, it's funny seeing donut shop coffee for a dollar or 50 cents more than Dunkin' Donuts. That, that don't seem right. But, and again, this may be something you want to take a photo of because this may not be the right price. I, you know, it's always, I always take a photo of anything I have in question so I can take it up to the register with me just in case they got it wrong or something. Uh, they do have the big things, the 10 ounce packs. We've gotten uh, people asking about this. They do have the 10 ounce bricks of the Cafe Bastello here for $4.49. $4.49. Somebody was wanting me to check out some instant coffees. Well, they have a few options here. I didn't see hardly any at Kroger the other day. They had the Taster's Choice, but those are like $12 for like a small thing of this. It's crazy. Um, they do have the Folgers here, $6.79. Nescafe Classico for $6.99. And the Cafe Bastello Espresso Instanio for $6.99. So got a few options here. Got some good deals on cereal this week. Uh, cereal two forty nine to three ninety nine. Buy one get one fifty percent off of equal or lesser value. It's pretty cool. I don't know if it just includes these here on this shelf. Let's go check the main aisle. Looks like all the cereals here. It is all of them from two forty nine to three ninety nine. Buy one get one of equal or lesser value. Fifty percent off. Let's see where you can make that work. Yeah, even this giant family size thing of Rice Krispies is only three fifty here. That's a good deal. You get one 50% off that. Yeah. Oh, okay. It even says on here. You scratched out the 350. Okay. Yeah, that's good to see. Cause, uh, but I mean, that would have included that because it's scratched out over 399. But anyway, that's good they did that just to let you know. Got the family size box of Apple Jacks there, 399. But that is included. Looks like all of it's included. Oh, that's cool. They don't carry too much, but they've got you know, good amount. I don't see any. I don't think they have any regular Cheerios. They got Honey Nut Cheerios. Whew, I thought Kroger was expensive. So these are $3.69 at Kroger, which is, yeah, expensive. But $4.29, yeah, that's crazy. Look at this. I was curious because we get comments on Red Mill products. I don't know if I've ever seen Red Mill oatmeal. I don't know if I've just passed this and just never paid attention to it before. Let me know down in the comments if this is any good. We get a lot of comments on Bob's Red Mill uh, flour and products of like that. So yeah, let me know if it's pretty good. It is $3.99 and you get eight packets. So somebody asked about these sparkling ice drinks the other day. Just walked past this end cap here. They still have them for 95 cents. I know you said yours had gone up to $1.29. Still 95 cents at Big Lots. But because of that, I would definitely take a photo of that. Make sure you get them for 95 cents. So the other day we were talking about the Brookdale hams. They do have the Royale hams here, which uh, we've got some kind of bad comments on this. So I don't really know. I've never tried it. $4.99 for that, though. Uh, they do have spam here. Uh, always getting comments on spam. $3.69, I swear. Price, price for spam is $3.69 all over the city here. They do have the Vienna sausages. These are, well, it makes them for less than a dollar, I guess. $4.79, still way too high for me. This was the cheapest place to get SpaghettiOs and Chef Boyardee. Uh, pretty much the regular price for Chef Boyardee everywhere else. Uh, SpaghettiOs have been $1.50 at a lot of different places, though, so a little cheaper here. Um, I, we got comments a couple weeks ago that you couldn't find SpaghettiOs or Chef Boyardee. Uh, a couple people had left comments over the probably the last couple few weeks, but one point out, Big Loss is another option. So we saw where Del Monte canned fruits are now $2.49 a can at Kroger. They are $2.39 a can here. They don't have as much of a variety. Uh, Green Giant vegetables, canned vegetables, $1.39. Um, $1.25 at Kroger, so definitely cheaper there. But some of this, these pineapple slices, like, boy, I remember when we could get these for a dollar. Not anymore. They are $2.39. And um, it's pretty close to, we'll, we'll see them on sale every now and then, but usually right around $2 everywhere. $2.39, yeah, I don't know. I mean, I guess if you really need it for something, 
you don't want to go to another store. It looks like they got the Kreider can of chicken back in. We got some good comments on this. It is $3.49 a can, and this is only 10 ounces. So the Brookdale one, which we like, uh, that's actually gone back down. That's $2.89 a can, and that's 12 and a half ounces at Aldi. So it was $3.19, but it had gone back down in price. Do have some of the Libby's pumpkin, 100% pure pumpkin here, $2.79. Um, we've been seeing that go up in price too at places. Got the Libby Sweet Peas here. Um, you know, somebody was asking about Libby's canned goods that they weren't able to find them at Walmart. We hadn't seen them at Walmart in forever. And just the other day, we saw that they were bringing them back in. But the great value, some of their canned goods are still on rollback offers for 50 cents a can, like the corn and green beans. So you may want to check that out. But they do have the Libby Sweet Peas here, $4.99. That's $1.25 a can been a lot of comments on prego sauce lately you know we saw it was very low at kroger but it was on a digital coupon for a dollar 49 so a dollar less than it is here uh 249 regular price here at big lots but yeah that deal is still going on today is december 18 sunday december 18 2022 so you will have until tuesday the 20th to get this deal at kroger dollar 49 a jar on the digital coupon you can get up to five of them so it looks like Big Lots comes in second place for the Hormel Completes Meals. We got another comment on this the other day. I did point out they're $2.14. Or no, I'm sorry. They went up to $2.24 at Walmart. They were $2.14. They went up a dime. $2.39 here. Most places, these are $2.69 to $2.99 now. If you're one who likes these meals... Big Lots is a little cheaper, and Walmart's definitely number one for the cheapest. Denty Moore for $2.39. We've been seeing these go up, too. Um, yeah, these are $2.69, too, at most places. So on one of our older videos, we got a comment about pasta the other day. So I did want to point out it's another option. I know you asked about Barilla, saying Barilla. It's gotten very expensive. It is. It is. It's $1.99 at Kroger. $1.89 here, so you're only saving $0.10, cents, but... They've got the regular spaghetti and I know that was the issue you had is you couldn't find the regular spaghetti. They got the thin spaghetti here too. And this is going to be the new box. Got some new new advertising brings higher prices, so that would trigger me to take a photo of that. Um, yeah, they got some of the bins ready rice down here. This, this stuff's been skyrocketing in price lately. They don't even have a price on it. Uh, this has gone up to two seventy nine a bag. Two seventy nine at uh, Target. But another digital coupon at Kroger for $1.50 a bag. $1.50 a bag. That's a great deal. Um, you can use up to five times. And that's going on until Tuesday. Uh, $2.79 regular price at Target. And $2.59 is going to be the regular price at Kroger after the sale. Somebody was also saying that you haven't been able to find the Idahoan potatoes. We uh, have been finding them pretty much everywhere. But I just wanted to show it as another option. And... A little cheaper here than we've seen at pretty much everywhere but Kroger. Uh, a lot of them go for $1.39 now, which is insane. But um, Kroger's has them four for five right now, so only a few pennies cheaper. They also have the Nor rice and pasta sides. These are $1.39 a bag. Pretty much same price everywhere. Okay, so I did want to go over the toys here for a minute. Again, a lot of comments. Check out Big Lots Toy Deal. Um, they do have buy one, get one of equal or lesser value, 50% off. This is on all toys, guys, all this week. And they got some really cool toys here. They got, like, Iron Man. Like, this one's $15, but it's, like, all, you know, it's got a lot of moving parts and everything. Got Woody here. Um, some of these toys that were, like, $10 last year, I feel like have gone up a few dollars. But look at this. Got He-Man and Skeletor. Get, get the command. $15 for that? Wow. I don't know. That seems a little much, but it's got a lot of extra stuff. I don't know. I feel like toys these days look way better, too. Like, they put a little more work into it. So, I don't know if your kids like Legos, but they actually have Legos on this sale, too. All toys buy one, get one 50% off. Got some Disney here. They got this little Spider-Man one here. Uh... Let's see, yeah, a couple little ones, some cheaper ones, yeah, you know, Legos have gotten so expensive, but I know there's a lot to them these days, um, but yeah, to get them, uh, buy one, get one 50% off, that's pretty good. 
So it wasn't actually on the channel here, but somebody, one of my friends asked me the other day if I knew where to get like party lights. And I just noticed that they have these uh, globe set lights here. I guess they're for Christmas. But uh, yeah, I got them here. It's like you can uh, take care of Christmas and put them on your porch afterwards or whatever you want to use them for. It's pretty cool. $12.99. I don't feel like that's too bad of a deal. Those look pretty cool. Found this cool little area right here. They got some little Mario toys and some Iron Man and Marvel toys here. Five dollars and under, but ninety-nine cents to four ninety-nine scratched off. Buy one, get one, fifty percent off. That's a good deal. So these would be like if you get both of these for seven fifty. It's pretty cool. Well, that is all the time I have for big lots today. You know, not the best prices. We've gone over how a lot of prices have gone up here in previous videos when we've done some shopping at Big Lots. Um, d definitely not the cheapest, but you know, the, one of the reasons we wanted to come here today because a lot of people have Big Lots all over the country here. And if you're having trouble finding some of these items, we were able to find some of them here. Uh, mostly Domino Sugar. Domino Sugar has been a big one. We get a lot of comments on that. And uh, just that people have been out of it. It's been out around here, too. Um, we found some as of late. We saw uh, Meyer had a little bit, but not much. And when it comes in, it's going right out the door. Somebody had also asked about the Red Mill Flower, which they also sell at Meyer and some at Kroger. They usually sell a bunch of different brands at Big Lots here that I wanted to point out. But they were uh, there was a guy who was restructuring the whole aisle of where that red mill flower goes, but they've got the coconut flower, the almond flower that a lot of you guys have been asking about. So uh, they do have that here. Not sure if the prices are still the same. The almond flower is a little more pricey, but guys, thank you so much for watching the video today. I hope you enjoyed it. With all that being said, I'm out and always remember the adventure is out. Thank you.